Hello there everyone and welcome back to Old World Blues, the series which we're playing as Farsun, of course A to Z, Farsun. But right now we're going to beat up the rest of the Barons I read. We've killed off 2200, we've taken 200 ourselves and totally didn't use Khan's commands like normal because this station is not super difficult to play as totally. But we have this effort done and we're going to beat the crap out of them. Finally we're at a place where the mole miners are looking decent. Organization we would like more, but we got over a thousand HP which makes up for the difference. I'm sure I don't know, with, with moles, I'm, I'm sure the devs have struggled trying to figure out exactly how to place them. I know robots was a big discussion, like how to exactly place them, especially between power armor and normal infantry, and then we have enforcers. Just trying to balance everything out, I'm sure it's, it's a huge thing to juggle. And, you know, I don't fault the devs for, you know, getting things right, wrong, you know, whatever. Uh, you know, it can be frustrating sometimes, I know, playing. Um, obviously, I complain a whole bunch sometimes. But who doesn't? Uh, uh, war sport. You know what? We're, we're, we're actually decent on war sports. Not too bad. But I uh, hope you guys are having a pretty good day. We are just beating the crap out of everybody here. Because we can. And then we're going to Glow's Cradle. Because technically we're, we have uh, the rest of the focus sheet to continue going down south, actually. But we're doing the Mole Mining Gauntlet. So if you're wondering about this, please go right ahead. We did core all of the Highland Watch, which was, which was nice. But now Wyoming dominated. The miners didn't take long to move in. How long could anyone stop them? The watch that had so heroically assembled had fallen despite the best efforts. Oh crap. Well, the best efforts, crap, no. Best efforts. Um, to uh, stem the mole tide. Now the boss was in charge, if that wasn't even the worst part. The worst part was that he was dissatisfied. He had some production, some more stability. That's nice. Um, we're missing uh, some of that there. What else are we missing? Anti tank. Scavenger trunk. We're actually doing okay. Ooh, whoa. Holy crap. We sent the, our guys on one trip, and they come back with a freaking geck. Gain one fully functioning gek, which we can use to improve our lands. Holy crap. That's insane. Um, so where can we use that? Old Jeffrey. Old Jeffrey, uh, yeah, I could probably use that there. Or oh, the dust. Um, the dust doesn't have that much population. You know what, I'm kind of okay with that. Nice, but when removed in three months. Two civvies, three infrastructure. Energy and electricity, or I guess the same thing. Electricity and um, water. Nice. <laughs> water or Walter. But anyways, we're gonna go to war with the Glow's Cradle next, because we work well in irradiated wastes. We work very well, actually. Well, maybe not special forces, but here, here. Oh yeah. That is our habitat: urban radioactive wastes, which look like rivers. Nice, but pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. And how about the settlements? We have 26 uh, settlements, or 26 factories, I should really say. We go do that. And I can't wait to use the trade node because we need money, god dang it. How would you look at this? A good, clean operation. With a cacophony of rattling breaths and irritable grunts, a team of mole miners, two dozen strong, made their way into the clearing outside boss Morgus, uh, Morgul's lair. More of the co-workers washed on from the loosely assembled barricades the creatures had erected to defend their radiated ruin from any who dared to trespass. These arriving miners were scavenging packs and had to bring, a pack, bring back anything useful that could be carried. Some carried the scrap metal, weapons and batteries that were expected to retrieve. Things that could be used for the boss's plans, even if none of the miners had a clue what those plans actually were. The rest, however, had their arms and pockets full of new items, bottles of beer and spirits, as well as boxes of cigarettes and cans. As they dumped their loot in the great pile, Security Chief Montague crawled forth from his collapsed office, several of his glowing uh, lieutenants in tow. He quietly hissed with delight while standing, stealing fearful glances at the lopsided building the boss would surely emerge from sooner or later. Drool dripped from his luminescent jaws as he scooped up the various intoxicants, either stuffing them into his gaps and pockets of his armor or shoving them into the arms of his subordinates. The miners milled about, watching this display with disinterest and confusion, and waited for the boss to emerge. The chief had impressed upon the team before they left that such items were vitally important, but they couldn't fathom why. Most of the booze and camps had been carried away and hidden within the collapsed ruins the security crew dwelled inside when heavy, thumping footfalls echoed from inside the boss's lair. Montague, hesitated by the spoils, piles, the rest of the ghoul scattered out of the view, trying to see if anything was left and not wanting to be seen running away. More ghoul emerged from the shadows of his home, bending down to fit through the doorway and moved to inspect the scavenger pack's offerings. All of it met with a silent approval until he reached down to retrieve a single bottle of beer, barely visible, in his few chance. Montague first avoided his boss's glare, then attempted to make an endearing smile with his remaining three teeth. 
Such tactics did little to blunt the huge Mole Man's rage, and Morgul hurled the bottle into the security chief's face. A single angry bark from the boss made it very clear to the miners and the stunned ghoul that no more time was to be wasted on such worthless treasures. Such was life for the moles. Nice. And I get production of more stuff. Beautiful. And let's beat up some ghouls. We're the only mutants that are allowed to be here right now. Uh, we should be fine. Oh, and we're going to lag as we get to June. Ah. Finally looking at least a little decent. Plenty of PP, because we love PP here on this channel. Nice, couple of days. Uh, two months left for that. We have no money. Pretty normal. Oh man, that is a lot of attrition. Oh boy. Go my moles. Wreak havoc on them. Nice. Uh, you actually might want to go that way. Special forces are still doing the best I can, but, you know. Hello. Smooth Toxer. Toxer. Talker. Beloved leader. Yeah, let's keep recovering faster. Dead Man's Junction. If we can get that, we should be pretty good overall. And then we'll really start hopefully coring a lot of the, these states over here, even though we got quite a bit of resistance, don't we? So let's lower it. Who needed manpower, right? That's right. I got a lot of divisions there. And we're actually taking out the Northern Tau too, which is good. Even though it is destroying like our ability to wage war here. Um, some more special forces, breakthrough, soft attack, hard attack, you know, good stuff like that. Oh, good, they're attacking us too. That's good to know. Let's hop out there. Because the ghouls, I'm sure they they perform extraordinarily well here. Hop out there. Now, that's a lot of divisions, holy crud. That is quite a few divisions. Oh, there actually is a... Oh, we got it. Nice. Carry an ambush. You know, we don't want them to do that. Um, nope. And then next up, I'm, I was pretty sure... Hounds of Day. Or Boros would have beat these guys. Are they... Are they... What's going on here? They're both at war, but they haven't killed each other off. What is wrong with the AI? Well, you can say a lot of things about the AI. Well, the riffraff, with stability, stability gain, meh. Not worth it. Two weeks left, very nice. And we're still building ourselves up here, which is very good too. Oh, we built a ship. We actually have the manpower for the ship. Okay, well, alright. We'll do your ship stuff then. Make us pretty. Wyoming well, dominate. Dry blowers, lone trees. Well, a uh, uh, mine deeper than our own. The boss was enraged to learn of the legendary deep mines and swore an oath that it would be in mole miner hands in no time. How could they be mole miners and not have the deepest mines? He set out to correct this fact as soon as possible. Hey, ma'am. We need some radios. The suit moves west. Lone Tree was a perfect choice for the boss. It would secure wider berth around the south passing for our sun, allowing a longer front to be maintained against the surface dwellers. Um, an escape from hardship. Many people stayed in Wyoming by accident. Maybe their caravan fell apart, maybe they just liked the people. Or maybe it was just the weather. These people are quick to chit-chat up the newcomers and work with the locals. The waters of Wyoming. Though they're far from safe to drink at such times, we'll get research slot. The lakes and rivers of Wyoming are far better than others found in the wasteland. With enough jury rigging, we can establish a set of purifiers help us with uh, thirst. Steps caravaneering. Vast steps for miles, and nothing but fast tracks of land between. While many great ranches do dot the landscape, few connections have been established between such places. Encouraging caravaneering would be a key to a reasonable economic growth. The Wyoming Calm. The calm chill of Wyoming is invited into much of the wasteland. With rumors of our hard work, lack minded individuals have begun to arrive up from all over. Settling winds. The settling winds of Wyoming have been an inviting premonition to travelers and wayfarers alike. Dozens of people pass through our lands more and more, staying every single day. The refineries, though they most certainly stay in the views. Numerous derelict factories dot the landscape. Let's see if we can get them back, some of them, online. And, uh, a home on the frontier. Bald eagle. Oh, yeah. No matter how amazing the land may be, without food to sustain it, they won't host anything for long. Looking at agriculture concerns would suit us quite well. Oh. Reboot power stations. The stars can only guide us so well. A proper power station would help us see us at night. Or see at night. And then, well, a heater, if we can find a functional one, that is, wouldn't hurt either. So tell me about it. Not having a heater that works? Oh, God. Tools to build a home. Scavenging is the baseline of any wasteland society. A trade both despised and respected by the majority. Equipping scavengers to go and see what they can get will save us a lot of legwork. I said, actually, why not kind of get down here? So, what is Wyoming or next? Yeah, also, I do want to show you this one too. So, I went down here, we had to make a choice. So, I went with more HP over initiative and organization. Organization is good, but since we already have so much HP, I'm like, you know what? Just add on more HP. Why not? 
And we'll get an initiative from like Recon and Chem Company and stuff with the Old World Blues Tech Expand-Up submod. Um, I went with Defense, because we have no armor or hardness. If you have no armor, you have no hardness, really, for your mole rats. Instead of uh, max speed, speed's okay. It's, it's the same as infantry. I mean, there's no need to get slightly faster, as far as I can tell. But Defense is kind of nice. And then I went with, could have gotten more better organization loss or even division experience. But there's only so much you can do with division experience gain. Or I guess I guess it's not, that's not army XP, that's division experience. It's only 5%. Mm. So I, rec rec I went with Recon. Recon isn't great, but we're going to use Recon anyway. So we might as well get more Recon on a Recon and intelligence gain from combat. And then we have Battlefield Scavenging, so better supply consumption. Way better Battlefield Supply Consumption and Equipment Capture Ratio, which isn't the most important thing, but it is what it is, you know. Um, Alright, well, we're at war. Let's see what we can do right here. We should be able to do fine. No guarantee, of course. Um, okay, do we need more water? Oh, water is more than fine right now. And support equipment? Ah, eh, we can use a spot of support equipment. It's only 10 PP. And what do we say on this channel? That's right, we love PP. We're PP lovers. Not mocha lovers, because he's dead. He's been dead for a while. Anyways, um, that'll work in. Uh, well, we could do that, but we could go down here and get some more manpower. You know, we're going to get 5,000 manpower. I mean, that just takes a long time for that focus to hit, but... 74%. Uh, yeah, we're doing way better than hounds a day. Oh, they're almost dead anyways. Nice. We can circle four divisions. Heck yeah. Here. Stay there so that they can't do anything. Yay, goodbye. Yay. Which means they actually might go to war with us, too. Yep, I knew that. I figured that they'd that, 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 do that. I can totally speak like normal. Ooh, we have no planes. Yeah, that makes sense. Are they at war with someone else too? Oh, they're just just fine against us. Forty days, huh? Well, that ain't bad. Um, they're looking not super strong. Nine to twenty-four divisions. Not a lot of manpower. Slightly more than us. I really want that research slot though. So I guess the suit moves west, which we already read. So. I guess we can also read the ending of the cycle. The greatest boss, the boss is greatest foe. Our borough stands tall against him. Warriors who fought with the knight just as he did. That vile woman, Akati, and her lackey, Jordan Day, have become his greatest nemesis seemingly overnight. It's worn out to rend them from the earth completely. Bones to rend. The dry bones been nothing to the boss. He was more interested in the strange, misshapen creatures that emerged from Burnham Springs, the Ganna and Moloch. Though he didn't understand them, he decided to control them as any tyrant would. First, however, he would have to secure the lamb. And among the giants, oh, of course, all technology, or of course, all states of technology, uh, also by Old Bones, Colorado mutant support. Ooh, the rare two creatures from Burnham Springs were resistant for a time, but soon the miners figured out how to weaponize them, just as other has had, and so the Takami, so Foss Sun grew in even more horrible ways. Nice. We're ready for war. Waters Wyoming. Oh, I want that fat manpower. They're not. They're not fat. We don't want them. That's right. It says that we're going to lose. Okay, so they went to war with us. Um, we just got to be smart about this. Can we go down here, maybe? They might be really t thick, tough guys. I, I, I don't know. Seeming to do okay. Failed successor. Goodbye. And that 500 manpower we got from that is going to be used up probably immediately. We're still mobilizing more, which is pretty nice. It's nice to have a manpower finally, right? Or like I say, a couple of divisions around there too, huh? Dredger, Lount. Follow the hang... Oh, God. Yep, there come the hang dogs. Lance is doing well. Grinding out that army XP. And you know what? We haven't lost all of our stuff there, huh? Get that one first. There you go. Shio's army's gone. Goodbye, Shio's army. 78. Oh, we have only two divisions left here. Nice, 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 nice. Scavenge vehicles, how much put, uh, we get 14. Let's see if we can trade a little bit more here, eh? We're gonna route from here to New Canaan. Yes, sir. How many trade notes can we find? Okay, cool. So we have two trade routes now. Pretty easy. Love it. Oh, do we lose or something? Well, yeah, it looks like this is gonna take a little bit of time, ain't it? Well, if that's the case. Y'all go here. At least start the fighting over here. I already have 41 naval XP. Go figure. We lost 22 versus their 48, which is not bad. Yeah, they should have like no manpower left, right? Yeah, pretty mi minimal. 
They have no demo equipment, which is nice. A lot of infantry equipment, though. Pretty normal. Oh, crap. They're just doing that other division there, too. Um, you know what? Since we're here. There you go. See what you can do. Help him out if you can. Because we are slowly going up on that RMXP level. Good. Ooh, Special Forces got tired. Not ideal. Keep throwing those divisions back in there, which kind of sucks for us. But in all honesty, it's probably going to take us a while, so we'll see you when we're close to done with oh, them. Oh, hounds of day. We're trying to kill them off as much as we possibly can. We've broken across the river, which is nice, but even then, I mean, the moles aren't... They're not stupendous. They're not fantastic. They're... Well, they're god dang it, they're moles. Um, but we're going to scavenge the vehicles, hopefully. We're still making how much every month? Oh, look at the Milo tribes. 19, huh? Beat the crap out of them. Get a little bit of help. The moles are coming for you, boy. Almost 1040. Well, I got a little more, slightly higher than 1040 HP, not bad. XP loss, not too bad either. Um, I think at this point, though, can we do a general attack? Uh, you know, even then, I'm not sure. Um, with you guys, you're going straight down there. You're going straight down. Right, right there. And you know what? You're going to help support the attack. This way, we can get down through here, take Moab, big old bomb. The circle have destroyed that at least one division there, and then take all this territory, and then there should be enough room for us to maneuver and uh, take them all on out. Because that is what we would ultimately like a do do. Oh, another division. Oh, three more more rat divisions. Finally, we actually can recruit more divisions. Oh my good lord. There you go. Head down there, head there. Hop out. Or you just go right there right now. You might as well. Because we're winning here anyways. Good, good, good. Not bad. Head down here. They have enough support up here anyways. Hop out, hop out. If you really want to be fancy, you go down there like that and go to Moab. Because the faster you can take Moab, the better they have no supplies. And we made three more Special Forces Divisions, too. Lovely. I like how we're training our boat, our one, like, canoe in land. In the land. Not on the land. Literally, just in the land. Good. Now we should be able to do a general attack with that many Special Forces Divisions and whatnot. It helps when you have manpower. It really does. And we're pretty much basic on all technology, so after this, ooh, Twin Mamas, I might want to take out Twin Mamas, because that's, Paradise has a lot of resources. And we shall go in and have a good old time, you, me, and destroy them all. Well, supposedly, trying to. There goes Kaiza, doing his Kaiza thing. Help him out. Nice, very nice. Urboros is ours, which is good, and they want you to get to Storm Creek and just kinda... Oh! Encircle them! Just go straight through them, it's fine. It's okay. Steps can't... Cabin... Caravaneering. We can do that one, but we'll end the cycle. Well, it's not the end cycle. Let's do a home on the frontier, like we read earlier. 48% done. Eh, that's sad. Scan just found nothing. Get out of my office. Hey! Paradise is next. And the launcher is going to take a long booty time to get through. There you go. Nice. That took forever to do. Ah, they actually have a few ships too. They could have sunk our canoe or whatever to build up. Ooh. You know what? We might just have them come out here to meet us. Let them take all this stuff. Oh, nice. Exactly what we wanted. Let them come on out. Ooh. Oh, so these ones are dead among the giants we read earlier, so if we read this again, please go ahead. Yeah. And then, what's oh, deep is now uh, ours. The deep mines were where they belong, under all minor control. Now the boss could live with a relative peace knowing that his mine was the deepest in all, in all the land. That'd be nice. Good. Let them come on out, spread on out. We have actually had to take two, too, so we should be fine. That's a lot of factories. For 50? Why not Riverton? Uh, sure. Okay, do that one too, because you can anyways. Alright, um, they're not spreading out, which is kind of disappointing. But no matter, we'll do this if we have to. Um, I want you guys to go here and here. Immediately. 
Help support the attack because you can at least encircle six divisions there. And you should have enough divisions to push on through. Nice. Very nice. Oh, we need more there, huh? Good. Oh. You're attacking us there, which is fine. As long as they can't move in there, that's all that I really care about. Come on. Oh, come on. I'll go right there. All I really wanted was to encircle them. That's all I really wanted. How much manpower do they have? Those 22 divisions have about a thousand. Well, I guess we'll have to wait and see then. If we can launch, I just, we just need to break through somewhere. That's all we really need. All that matters. Nice, more moles are good. <laughs> They're forcing the defense too, holy crap. They're like super serious about not losing territory. Home the frontier is good, and we'll do this one too. Bashing our heads in against these guys, huh? 39 versus 460, and they're using, they are using robots too. So with all that stuff done, let's go with hills this time. Hills and Mountaineers and whatnot. And you can see we're struggling quite a bit, but you know, what else is new? Eventually we're going to do Down in the Darkness. With our borough and surrounding environments now under the control of the Far Sun, uh, the boss set to side on another phone, the battery of Mesa Verde and the men and women of the Black Canyon. The land was too vast and their influence too great on the western mountains. They had to go, lest the boss go mad from rage. Which is very true. Because this one's, I know it's, it's going to take forever to try to beat up lone trees. It just really is. Um, did I read all these? Rebooting the power stations? Yeah, I'd read that one. Tools to build a home. Yeah. Building up ourselves. Yeah, but to build a civilized society, you must build capable... Be capable of building in the first place. Scavengers deployed and the power stations will help us get the power, power equipment to try and start expanding. And nowhere can be home, too. Yeah, Wyoming is a beautiful place, almost certainly nowhere, but where else is this there to be in the world? If not, nowhere. Well, Diana is dead, but the Lone Trees are uh, giving us a little bit of run for our money. We've lost, actually, only 20, which means how good our HP really is. Uh, but we've killed off 1300, which is pretty nice. We've broken through the south here. And I think now would be a good time to maybe start of striking them uh, here. You know, we don't do a lot of damage and all, but which really sucks. But we're doing all right overall. Um, how about all but you just go that direction, and you take a couple guys and go down there. Once these guys are taken care of, we should be able to find do and do a general attack. We already have their cyber broken and whatnot. Um, keep them in place. Uh, that'd be for the best. You guys, you're not doing anything, so help them out. Look at that, beautiful. Go, my moles, and we do have uh, our general here, a purveyor, Mrah, who sucks because he only has four out of four. And then we have general, uh, or unit leader, uh, Scaver Nat. So let's get our boys on the line. We'll do a general attack, break their cyphers, which we've already broken, but actually use that broken cypher, and uh, keep building up roads because we've got a lot of 100% around here. Holy crud. Rollins. All right, three, two, one, come on. Let's get going. Y'all take him forever to get to your rigging lines. My god. That takes so long. But we do have some Gehennas, which are daily support uh, things for our dudes. Colorado Mutant Support does hurt our organization, but it does give us quite a bit more uh, soft attack, a little more breakthrough, a little more defense, and 30 more HP. Oh, that's considered special forces, eh? Yeah, we're doing those special forces. Oh, oh man. Oh. So probably definitely can't do that then. Oh, that sucks. Oh, we'll go in. See what we can do. Can we nosh against some people here? Oh, they're forcing the attack. Or forcing defense, I should say. That sounds like we should force the attack then. And then, uh, trap land attackers. Oh, yes, please. As much as I want the normal plans, we'll make enough of that later on. Nice. Plasma. Wait, we found plasma. I should, oh, we're not even using plasma though. We're using moles. We're not using. Bruh. 
I guess we got democracy, that's good. Um, yep. Ooh, that's a lot of time, so we're gonna do that one anyways. We're gonna do 88. Why not? More user speed? Still waiting for that, uh, like, fourth research slot. Good lord, it takes forever. But we're doing alright down here. Not fantastic, or, you know, but we're doing alright. Uh, I guess Life Giver, maybe? I hate Lone Wolf so much. It makes sense to have it in the game, and I don't want the Death to ever take it out, but I just don't like it. Got a week left of it. Ah, we did cut them through, but that left us very exposed. God dang it, you ding dong. Hope we all go there. Keep them in place, we did break through, which is good. Nice, nice, nice. Heavens get clear one high chapel. Go there, we're gonna circle all these divisions. Oh, and they're forcing the defense again. Good for them. Now die. Because they have been completely cut off from any sort of supply through here, which is really good, actually. Oh, good. Go ahead. Having your spirit is a good thing. Oh, we can do some damage here. Oh my god, there are 14 divisions trapped here? Oh, yes please. It's bopping them all. And they all got bopped. I love it. I guess technically Black Canyon is the next one target, so. Oh, okay, they're expanding out to Vault 27 too. Building ourselves up, so now we're gonna be home too. Nice, very nice. They're attacking us as we're attacking them. Kind of strange, but it kind of works. Um, rejecting the gifts. They have seven divisions left. No manpower, which is good. We'll get them done. Because after that. Down with the darkness. Yeah. We could do that. Or we could just justify against these guys. Do have quite a large border with them, though. It's like the 20 army will go here. Oh, wow. Legs are doing quite well themselves. And do we have any other waterways? No, it might be only one big old thing there. Okay, well, that makes it easy. Academia is nice. Research speed, political power, all sorts of good stuff like that. Come on. There we go. Now they're all trapped in a single single tile. And, oh god. This is four division, but they really have six left, because we got to destroy all their organization here, too. Oh, we did Northern Cons. Nice. And we did do this one too. We got more uh, soft attack, organization, max speed. I guess we could have done this one too, but we don't really benefit from this one fully. Because we don't have any no nightkins. And behemoths don't get a buff. We just get plus 40 special forces minimum capacity and more mobilization speed. And that's it. So I didn't think it would be worth it for us to do that one. But we're done with the land auction, which is nice. Research speed and point one. There you go. Or do we wait for them to beat up uh, Vault 27? Probably not. Black Canyon, it is. And two more divisions left.
for Creon. Oh, I mean, it's already over. The war, we got the Sapper done since the war's over. God dang it. Who needed capital ships? So overrated. White legs looking mighty thick and down with the darkness. Well, it's gonna get bypassed anyways, but whatever. Finally, fourth research slot. Oh my god, it took so long to get that. So after that, we uh, west we shall go. Plans on all of Utah, Montana, and Wyoming, or Colorado. We'll get some mini nukes. Um, I like Wyoming and Montana because we haven't really expanded that far north yet. Greater Yellowstone, so almost all these territories. Oh. Even up in southwest Montana, too. Even, oh god, we do have to fight MacArthur. I, I, I definitely don't want to go to Colorado, because that's just too much of a mess up down there. Um, and I don't want to fight the White Legs, either. Go. Well, all right, let's see what them Black Canyon folk got for us. Although we can do well. Definitely struggling in some areas here. Even with their sappers broken. Mole rats are not known for attack. Then again, I've not upgraded their guys for quite a while, but you know, whatever. <laughs> whatever. Communication. Fine. I feel normal. We got four research slots. Thank God. Whew. And we're like, yeah, get Kriog. Doing alright. Northern section is doing okay. This section is doing okay. The perfect. Not so re. No so re, but we're getting there. Mold Town. That's exactly why we go to war with these guys. For Mold Town. That's gonna take a while to break through. It's gonna take a while to break through here too. Oof. That's why God invented the plane. Uh, a little bit of damage. Finally, we put the group behind. Be nice. There goes the ball of heaven's gate. Bye, heaven's gate. Twenty seventy come on, that's pretty good. Melee, nice. Oh, we had the time for us. More liability, maybe? Beautiful. But then we gotta go through them glow bugs, which I guess these guys can deal with the glow bugs. I don't wanna deal with them. Look at that. Uh, they're only glories. To the north, the boss turned himself there towards the homes of middle-class humans and their arsenals of weaponry. Hungry for the wealth and craving violence, he whipped the miners into frenzy and led the way in Old Montani. And then atomic mining techniques. The mole millionaires do not celebrate the success, but boss. Uh, Morgul cannot help but spend the day barking happily after inspecting the newest pile of loot dragged before him. And instead of the heap, buried under old crystals was a crate of untouched mini nukes. Ooh! Love it! Nice. No, 
now do they want to go with this? Um, what would be better? Honestly, probably grenades. Just to help, like, blow things up, because we're miners. This black staff. Um, I guess cons are next. Wyoming and Montana, huh? Plague lands, that's Nebraska. God, I don't want to fight MacArthur. <gasps> about what I expect. I don't think I've ever fought... Well, maybe I've fought in the Northern Cons before, maybe? I'm sure I have. Metal Mouths. Nice name, nice name. Oh, whoops, I forgot about those guys. My bad. We should just found them too. Northern Glories. And Commandy Training. Barstown has been much more of a challenge than I thought they would be. Because I like the unique focus right here, but it's just so challenging. Nice. Hey, we got one at our air XP. A whole one! Two lifetimes, very good, very good. Better recovery rate, defense, and reliability, yes, please. Six forty days for that. Thirty five days ain't too bad either for that, too. Okay, so we got a lot of days left. We can take out quite a few people here, huh? Metal Mouths, MacArthur. Even all the way up, to, up here. Holy crap. Northwest Montana. Oh my god, we're gonna get real big, ain't we? We're gonna about get huge. But let's save real quick, just in case. And we'll take out the Northern Cons, shall we? Oh, very nice. Very good too. Don't get cores on any of these people, but that's alright. 56. 72. 104. And we're done with that. Nice. There goes Bismarck. Goodbye, Bismarck. Oh crap, why do we need so many moles? We have to double up on something. Yeah, organization, max speed, heart attacks, off attack, you know, recovery. Experience soldiers losses goes down. Looking alright. Why do we need so many moles? I don't understand. I'm glad we're making more, I guess. Uh, how many are we using in each division? A thousand moles. God dang, they thick. Those are some thick moles, man. Grand Inquisition. Yuck. Oh my god, look at that. Grand Inquisition looks really cool. Oh yeah, that's really nice. They have three different ways you can go. Yakima Confederation. Wow. Good. Go my thousands and thousands of moles, rat hordes. Take them all out. Show them a good time. Maybe like you know, like a dinner or something. I don't know. Maybe tea, a movie night dinner. research faster, faster, faster. They think we're stupid. Well, we kind of are. But not as stupid as people think we are. Mm 
Nice. Double BRs. We've lost only 28 versus 2,000. Feels like we lose more than that, but, you know, whatever. And we'll get ready to go to war with MacArthur. And so, you know, mole rat miners, you know, mole rat cohorts versus power armor, it's going about as well as you think it would. It's not going fantastic. Um, and especially with when they have power armor, like, basically enclave power armor, it's very tough to crack. Even our special forces are struggling a little bit with them. Um, so, as you can tell, it's just not going great. But we have encircled quite a few divisions of MacArthur's. They're up to 31 divisions, and uh, casualties are about basically what we really expected here. Fort St. Anthony, and uh, do the best you can go around all of them as best you can, too. Uh, let's see, do that, do that, do that, and go up there, maybe? I don't know, we'll see. Yeah, it's, it's definitely going. We, we're only doing well just because we encircled them. Oh, God, we actually, they actually beat us up. Yeah, we lose instantly to them. Oh my god. So hopefully with them taking at least a somewhat... Some, a some attrition. We actually beat the divisions. Oh god. Wow. That's amazing. <coughs> oh god, they have even more divisions over here too. But the special forces are not as bad to take out. Hopefully. Oh god, we just can't beat them there. Alright, so now there's encircled, which is good. Thank god. Jesus Christ, that took quite a while. Uh, hopefully we can beat them up here. It was actually, they, they have air superiority. They're actually doing some damage to us. Not bueno. Oh, I'll go up there. Yeah, there are three power armor divisions up there. Not ideal. But it is what it is. Oh, and let them die. Oh, they, they're literally enclave power armor divisions, which is, of course, very, very tough to be. Very, very tough. Bozeman, beautiful place. This is the last time I remember it being there. And, uh, go, go, no, you go through there. You go through there. Ooh, oh, we actually got him. Look at that. Go figure. Uh, I'm going to actually have you, the special forces, which are tankier than anyone else. You guys go there. You four will go right there and do what you need to. You 12 will actually go up here and start taking as much of that towel, those towels as you possibly can. As you 20 are just trying to wrap everything else up to. So, yeah. See what you can do. As we lose almost instantly against these power armor divisions. Which, like I said, is pretty much expected at this point. But we do have a lot of air stuff here. Air XP, holy crap. I assume that they... Oh, we have... Oh, we, oh they have blimps. Look at that. We, of course, we do have triplane attackers. But they do have blimps. And blimps are oh, crazy. But we do have a cup of coffee here. Not much coffee left. But some coffee, nonetheless. I'm not a caffeine addict, I swear. I just can't sleep at night, ever. More mole rats. Nothing like a good mole rat. You're gonna go on this side. There you go, have fun. So they now have up to 18 divisions. They've lost 2,000 manpower, pretty decent overall. Can you guys actually get down there? Oh, you can, oh, you go this. Is that, how, are they, how is that tile accessible? Oh, it's just one tile, maybe. I'm like, oh, that doesn't make any sense. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, hello. Hello, lag. There you go. Go, mole rats. Go. Where are their divisions? They said they have up to 18. Right, they're trying to urbanize. Maybe we should have went for the speed. Oh, well. civvies, some millies, some infrastructure. We're out of advanced components. That's not good. For some reason, we still need to craft some more mole rats, though. And I want more planes. Trapline detectors are where it's at. Mole rats. Mole rats. Papa mole rats. Missoula. Oh, well, since you're here anyways, here. Uh, do that, and go through there. And go to do that. Special forces are extra special, and that's the way we like them. You guys go up through there, and go that direction. Have fun. Don't die too much. There you go. Go, my rat babies. I said go. So how about we go? 
Okay, they clearly do not like listening to me. They're like Pokemon you trade in the game before you have all your gym badges. They just don't listen, do they? Nice. So far, not bad. A couple more people to take out, and that'll be good. Where are their divisions? They have up to 17 left. They must be all be in the capital. Oh my god, this is disgusting. Just do that. Just go up, go around, and do that. There you go. That's all you need. Go. Let's go to Missoula. And you go down here and just take all these small little crevices. And we're done with this page, finally! Well, manpower would be nice, but we don't really need that one too much. Weekly plus two manpower, sure, totally is going to help us out now. Totally. Bio okay, caps economy. Ooh, we can do stuff here too, which would be pretty good as well. No, no. Ooh, army supplies. Oh. Oh, we did want to make some nukes, didn't we? Gehanna's nukes. Oh, oh make, make five a year. Ah. Uh -huh. Or we could save the army XP up. Yeah, let's do that. Nice. Ah! So we found a few more divisions. Interesting. All the way down and around, and then you're gonna beat the crap out of those guys. That'd be good. If you could actually beat them up. Okay, you don't want to beat him up. That's not good. Provides tools, construction speed, always good to get. Ah, the power armor's back. Granite, oh god, it's Granite Company. Oh, you're fighting me, that's fine. Nice. See the lake. And you're just taking all the territory up here too, which is good too. Missoula is a frontline city. Hopefully we do not get encircled here, for the love of God, please do not get encircled. Okay. Makes me feel just a little bit better. Ships that we're totally going to use. Where's the next capital? Oh, Winifred? Huh. Help them out, get rid of them. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. I don't think we've had sappers done for these guys yet, so. After these guys, we'll go to war with the metal mouths. That sounds really painful. I already did that. Okay, good. And. Or these guys. Either one doesn't matter to me. Oh, I can't train anymore, I think. Oh, I can actually throw some more stuff on there, though. Can we do that? No. Fire teams? Yes. Slightly a bit, bit more strength. Be very nice. Grenade rifles, very good. Kaboom. Oh, there's forces over here. Nice. Hey, economic perceptions is a great thing too. Havre? Havre? Cut bank, and you can go this direction. To Blackfeet. What do we like? We like Blackfeet. Anyways. Please tell me once we get a hover, making this front line would be worthless, right? Nice. Overall planning's not bad. Mandatory service. More organization. A few more rats. My god, MacArthur. What else do we need from you? Oh, they're all the way over there? What the heck? Bruh. How's that their capital? There's no way that's their capital. No flipping way. There we go. That's what I thought. That's what I thought.
It's like 40 cases, very nice. Uh, so about 19 here. I need a few plump divisions to do that. Four sounds pretty good for something like that. Special forces can go right here. And right here. And right there. I'm good luck, 20s. Good luck. You're probably going to need it. Nope. Oh, we're already over here, too. Actually, that'll help distract them as we push into their main uh, front lines. So that should be really nice. NCR wants to invest in us. Do we even... Are we... What? Do we have a border with the NCR? No. Kaiser's Legion is now gray because of Iron Alliance, but even then, I guess we will technically have them. Uh, I don't want to become a puppet of them. I don't want to. I just don't want to become a puppet. Oh, they're actually fighting the Sky Reavers too. Look at that. Leave us alone and we'll be fine. We'll go with that one. We'll use your stupid currency if we have to for now. Nice. Get these few few more fives, but that's alright. Are we ready to go? Come on. What is taking you so freaking long? We're all generally in the same area, so I'm not super concerned about uh, us not being able to do what we need to do. Ooh. Honestly, I'm not sure if there's any benefits to doing any more of these. Uh, recount would be good, but I want to maybe save uh, a few slots for terrain, perhaps. I think that'd be for the best. And you know what? We're technically programmed to go down and do asymmetric warfare. So let's do asymmetric warfare. I almost always do conventional warfare. Sometimes we refine warfare, but that doesn't matter for us. And robot warfare has nothing to do with us for this campaign. Guess I'll use more money. Oh, so that done. Might as well use it, right? Actually, ruminators, do you have... Ah! I like bricks. Device tools. Ah. Secret so meatloaf. Declared war on free Vegas. So be it. Very nice. Looking decent. Oh, that was much faster than I thought what would happen. Do we have any secret way into our base? No, I'll take out the Ruminators next. I don't think... Oh, oh god. Standing Rock does. Oh god. It's uh, a big old front line. I don't think you guys have... Yeah, no. Oh, even you guys too? Wow. Alright, we get over that. That's why I gave you more recovery rate. Need core more stuff too. There we go. And looking pretty good. Of course, I think we're fighting over a river here, aren't we? Yeah, we are. Which is why it's not going as great as it probably should be. There you go. Nice. 
this will help spread all over the place. Help, help them out there. Beautiful. Help them out there. They are, of course, in the defense, too, so that's not good for us. Another river to cross. Pretty normal. Good. Fall. Oh! Oh, the Van Graffs are doing very, very well against the NCR. Oh my god, they're fighting Pecos. So the NCR is fighting a lot of different people at the same time. Kaiser's Legion, the Texan Economic Union. Holy crap, that's the biggest Texan Economic Union I've seen in a very long time. And they're trying to fight the Van Graffs. Holy crap, all of Texas. you fighting all of Texas? Oh, California v. Texas. Oh, please, let it happen. Nice. Good. Thank you, Ruminators. Uh, how strong is Stank Rock? Oh, they have like no divisions. What the heck? There we go. Oh, we're out of manpower again. Dang it. Um. More manpower, please. Alright, send rescue team. Uh, expedition. Oh, paradise. That's worth corn. Uh, 9,000 is not. Oh, 50,000. Oh, yeah, down here is definitely worth corn. Uh, that should definitely help us out quite a bit. Pretty much good to go whenever. Because I did want a little bit more planes, but it looks like we don't have enough for now. Which really sucks. Oh, we just pop up with another 5,000? Holy crap, okay. We're using horses. They don't have enough divisions to hold the line, so we're just going to straight move on. Oh, they have another crap. That's like actually our core territory, too. Well, another general. The crown. Add X two. We come would be nice. Ah, uh, worst part. Come on, moles, move faster. That is not good for us. I hate their horses so much. They just move so fast. Go there, come on. What are you doing? Monsters of the East. Oh, I'd give him mini nukes too. Kinda nice. There you go. Reserves. Sure. How are we losing to them? They have a lack of energy cells. What the fuck? What in the world? Yeah, moles are just very difficult to use. Come on, let's go to Casper. It's the only ghost.
I mean, I've only lost 184, but still. There we go. Now they're winning. Got Casper back, which is good. Asymmetric hey, Warper's done, nice. Almost 10,000 is pretty good, too. Saves a little more manpower, helps us uh, with our. Make sure we don't capitulate anytime soon. Stand the rock ain't so rocky. Ah, finally, we got him. Oh. It's a little frustrating fighting these guys. But the mole rats always, or mole, mole rat cohorts always pull through. Nah, let's get more recovery and even more HP, because why not? We can never have enough HP. City. Come on. Would someone like to take White Horse? My god. There we go. Because we don't need to take White Horse. Shut yourself over there. Okay, now we got plenty of mole rats. 45,000? Nice. Um, planes. Yeah. Nope. Alright, so with that in mind, um, South Wyoming, East Utah, Colorado. I guess I think we can go over this direction because we need to take out the luminous ones. Uh, you know what? I don't care. There's enough hole there. We should be able to move fast enough, right? All right, you got. Uh, you know what? You four can go this way. Do that. Another mini nuke, please, and thank you. Cool, and recon got done, then maybe we'll throw more recon on our, on our guys. I'd like to throw those on, but we just can't quite do that. Oh, yeah. Screw recon for these guys. I wanted those super mutes. Nice. Do we have anything for the baggers? No? Okay. Anything for... Oh, even Vault 27 too, huh? There you go. Gunsmithing. Demo team stuff. Nice. So they immediately attack us there, and we attack them there too. Do we have a sack for them? Yes, we do. Nice, there you go. How's their damage? 34, 37, not bad. Oh, that's pretty good too. 109. Beautiful. It looks like we do worse than we actually do, but we only lose like 60. I mean, it's not bad. That's really good. Jug water. Thank you. Oh, no manpower. Didn't need a manpower, right? Didn't need manpower. Alright, so they only have... So many places where they can enter in. I 
I don't think we can take them on if we do a two front war. But I might be insane enough to do that. Oh, there you are. There you are. Air bases here. Two and of course we have no manpower, which sucks. Nearly ten thousand up here. Oh, we need more cores over here, though. Go and do that one real quick. Can we hold out against these guys? Because I knew they would start attacking us like crazy. Oh, they are actually attacking us, huh? We can do that with mini nukes. We can do that, too. With their stuff for broken. Looks like probably not. Army XP, we could, I guess, invest in that, it's fine. Just getting up on all of them. And we're doing, we're delivering way more casualties than they're delivering to, delivering to us, but. Nice. And more HP is good, too. So how strong are these guys? Oh, they're almost out of manpower. They're 24 divisions, max. No manpower, kind of like us. Nice. Three divisions have been a circle. Start letting the mini nukes fly again. Yeah, mini nukes are actually helping helping save us because this is just a big old grind through all this stuff. We get down to here, we can cut them off, or even right here too. And guys, let's go for the capital, go for these small little spots, and we'll have them. Yeah, but not having enough manpower is a really big issue for this nation. Oof. Nice, even more HP and recovery rate. More soft attack, good. So, a standard mole miner division now has 1065 for HP. Not bad, organization sucks, but you know, whatever. We got him, but I don't think I'm going to take up that nation at the top, the Nips, Nipsey one. I think we're looking pretty good overall. Our son, we've done, we've done quite a bit. So, if you enjoyed the campaign, though, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.